So the situation that happened over the weekend at the Oscars between Will Smith and Chris Rock is far from over. Last night, we reported that the Oscars released a statement stating that they asked Will Smith to leave and he refused. Now we are getting conflicting reports about that. And Chris Rock is breaking his silence during his first public appearance for his tour. And a lot of people are wondering why was Jada Pinkett even laughing at Chris Rock's jokes after Will Smith slapped him. Welcome back to the Kempire Daily YouTube channel where you get daily and consistent hot topics in music, entertainment, reality TV, and so much more. As always, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on breaking news when we go live or when we upload. So there's a lot to unpack here, and I thought we were done last night talking about this Will Smith story, at least until the Oscars decided what they were going to do in regards to consequences. As I reported yesterday, the Academy released another written statement condemning Will Smith's actions at the show and saying that they did ask him to leave, but he refused. Now, conflicting reports are coming out today to say that the Oscars did not ask him to leave. So this is what TMZ is reporting. But before we get into what TMZ is reporting in regards to that, what we are hearing is that the Academy never considered forcibly removing Will Smith. They said Will was asked to leave the Oscars. We know that. But despite his refusal to leave the Dolby Theater after he slapped Chris Rock, forcibly removing him was never an option, TMZ has learned. They say LAPD sources tell TMZ the cops who were inside the venue were never consulted about removing Smith. Something we're told that would have been done if the Academy wanted him out one way or the other. This is part of the reason why I'm telling you this before we get into them saying that he was never asked. So as TMZ reported, Academy President David Rubin and Academy C CEO Dawn Hudson were furious at Will and there were plenty of yelling backstage with Will's reps after the slap. According to TMZ sources, they said it didn't take long after for the officials to make it clear they wanted Will out of the auditorium. The exact words used to his reps were unclear, but as we reported, Will refused to exit. Then comes this story today that, who knows, it could be Will Smith's people putting this out there to do damage control because this is not looking good for Will Smith. According to TMZ, they're saying this Will Smith was never asked to lead the Oscars after he slapped Chris Rock. In fact, the opposite is true. He was told by the producer of the show he could stay. This, according to sources, with direct knowledge to people who were present. As you know, by now, the Academy said Wednesday that they had asked Will to lead the Dolby Theater after the slap, but he refused. Three sources who were at the ceremony, though, and witnessed various conversations tell TMZ, yes, after the slap, Academy officials were backstage with Will's reps, and they were there were heated conversations about what had gone down. We're told there was a split among officials. Some did want him booted, but others did not. There were various discussions during several commercial breaks but they never reached a consensus according to tmz they said that they're told will was aware that there was talk about asking him to leave the theater during one of the commercial breaks we're told oscar producers will packer walked up to will and said we do not want you to leave this is according to what to tmz sources Will Packer walked up to Will just after 8 p.m around 35 minutes after the slap that's when he told Will, he could stay, according to our sources. Will won the Best Actor Award around five minutes later. A lot of you were in the comments yesterday when we reported on the Oscars statement. And a lot of you said, I don't believe it. I feel like they're doing damage control. Honestly, at this point, it does feel like they're definitely doing damage control. Because we literally saw a crime. A crime, no matter how you feel about it, right or wrong, it is a crime under California law, under any state's law, really. We saw a crime happen on national television, national, global television. Now we have footage, footage from another angle. And you know, when we did the town hall, I said, it seemed like it was a long walk. When you see this footage, no, it actually wasn't a long walk. They were pretty close to the stage. And there have been so much back and forth on whether or not people uh, on how people feel about Jada and Jada's control over Will. I don't want to get into that conversation because at the end of the day, Will is a grown ass man. He makes his own decisions. However, when you see this video footage from another angle where someone's right behind Lapita, anyone check on Lapita and Jada, 
you see Will coming back from after the slap and Chris Rock makes a joke. Jada laughs. Then we have Will Smith say, you know, keep my wife's name out of, my, out of your effing mouth. Here is an angle most people have not seen. Look at Jada's reaction. And she just looks over at him. And some people might say, okay, Jada, that could have been your point to say, well, well. And it doesn't have to be a big, well, stop it. No, well. She doesn't. Chris Rock makes another joke. Jada laughs. Could it be a nervous laugh? Honestly, if I was offended by something that a, a, a comedian said, would I be laughing at the follow-up jokes? I don't know. I haven't been in that instance. But there are a lot of people reporting on interesting to see Jada laughing. I don't think she was laughing at the slap. I definitely, based on what we see in the footage, it seems as if she's laughing at Chris Rock's jokes and his reaction to being slapped on national television. Well, Chris Rock is also reacting. You know, his tour has been doing amazing since this happened, unfortunately. But fortunately, at the same time for him, he does say in this first tour date that he's still processing the situation and he confirms that the two have not spoken everyone's looking at you diddy why would you say anything diddy if that didn't happen or were you just repeating hearsay well <laughs> this situation keeps taking twists and turns but as always i want to know your thoughts thoughts on jada's reaction after the slap your thoughts on the, the back and forth of did the Oscars ask Will to leave? Honestly, I don't believe that. If they really wanted Will Smith to leave, I don't care who Will Smith is. If they really wanted Will Smith to leave, they could have had Will Smith be removed. Honestly. But as always, let's continue the conversation below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on breaking news when we go live or when we upload. Thanks for watching.